Hello fellow Star Wars fans, my name is Star Raptor and welcome to the channel. I'm very excited to bring you a review for a long-awaited Star Wars reference book. This is Star Wars Dawn of the Rebellion, written by Pablo Hidalgo and Emily Scucani. So this is going to chronicle the events, the important events and characters in between the events of Revenge of the Sith, going up into the events of Rogue One. Everything from video games to comics to novels to movies to series, live action and animated, this thing covers them all. So what I really like is first off, we start off with a timeline of the events, you know, that go from the creation of the Stormtroopers over to the rebel cells that are operating closer to the events of A New Hope. So this is organized in a way that I really appreciated, where it's not just going by different things like and or Obi-Wan. Everything is organically arrayed in a kind of organization that makes sense. So you're talking about, you know, the Inquisitorious. It's including characters from Jedi Fallen Order, Jedi Survivor, then it includes Rebels, and it includes, you know, uh, Obi-Wan Kenobi. We learn a lot more about Obi-Wan Kenobi. I like how it's organized by planets as well. You see stuff based on Tatooine, different storylines based on Ryloth, which include Bad Batch, which include Star Wars Rebels. We get to see a lot of cross-sections of really cool ships, like the Millennium Falcon, like Luthen Rail's um, Fondor ship. We get to see all the inclusions of the different types of stormtroopers. You get to see all the different types of Star Destroyers, speeder bikes, everything from the criminal organizations, you know, the five different kind of criminal organizations there. We get to see a sneak peek at some stuff from Andor. You get some little glimpses at things like, oh, maybe we'll learn more about the a backstory of Luthen Rail, uh, different things like this. So this is a long time coming. Um, we haven't gotten one of these in this kind of format since I believe 2019 with the Rise of Skywalker. These have been sorely missed. I absolutely love these. I love all the, de the designs. The layouts are absolutely gorgeous. These entire page spreads of cities and having little details that just add to the lore, add to the overall uh, world building of Star Wars. These are the world building books where we're going to go back to time and time again and we'll see different things spark from the lore that's brought up in these. Yeah, so overall, I can't recommend this enough. If you've been waiting for a new Star Wars uh, reference book, this is going to be one of the best ones out there to grab, honestly. Andor, Obi-Wan, Bad Batch, Rebels, so much good stuff in here that gives you a little bit more context. I think that's the biggest thing I took away from this book is the amount of context. When everything is put together in this format, you're getting everything calling back to this or calling back to that, uh, depending on the mediums that they're involved in. It really adds to that cohesiveness that makes Star Wars stand alone from every other fictional universe out there as the end all be all. So what do you think about Dawn of the Rebellion? Are you guys going to pick this one up? Let me know in the comment section down below. For more on Star Wars, you're already in the right place. Go ahead and subscribe to this channel and do not forget to hit that bell icon so you'll be notified when future videos go live. Also, hit that like button. Show some support. That's the best way of doing it. It's going to allow other people to find this channel and take part in this very positive Star Wars community that I've built here on Star Raptor. Well, that's going to do it for me. Thanks for watching and may the Force be with you always. Thanks for checking out the video. Please hit that thumbs up symbol. It helps me know that I'm making content that you guys enjoy. And if you enjoyed this video, I also included two videos down below you guys should check out. And please consider subscribing to this channel. It helps support me and it notifies you guys of when I get new videos up on the channel. You can also contact me on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram at Star Raptor.